Greetings everyone. My name is Shubham Mahajan. Greetings everyone. I am Prabh Vora. Greetings everyone. I am Gurang Goyal. Greetings everyone. I am Manav Bhatia and we all are from St. Mark Senior Secondary Public School Mirabagh, New Delhi, India. The digital revolution is far more significant than the invention of writing or even printing. This was rightly quoted by Douglas Engelbert because in this pandemic situation we could see that not only education but many other activities shifted to a digital mode. We chose this topic to focus on key areas of digital revolution and how it has witnessed a rise during the pandemic. Due to the COVID-19 outbreak followed by lockdowns worldwide, many businesses shifted to the digital mode. The Indian government came up with new solutions of payment like e-rupee was launched. Also, work from home was promoted amidst this time globally. Now, the major question arises, what is digital revolution? Digital revolution also known as the third industrial revolution is a shift from mechanical and analog electronic technology to digital electronics which began in the later half of the 20th century. From the given pie chart we can observe that 71.40 percentage of people are aware of the term digital revolution while 21.40 percentage of people are not aware of the term digital revolution and 7.10 percent people are not sure whether they have heard this term or not We began our research by collecting the information on how our world witnessed a digital revolution during this pandemic. We conducted surveys through questionnaires from which the data was collected and analyzed. We conducted surveys to gauge the representativeness of views and experiences of people. To understand the opinions of family members, businessmen and teachers, we conducted various online as well as live interviews following the precautions. During this pandemic, work from home has become a common part of our life. Being an engineer to a common businessman, everyone has been shifted to an online mode. Due to work from home, people are not only safe in their households but are also close with their family members in these devastating times. Thus, we can say that it is only because of digital revolution. Whatever problem arises, work shall never stop. That is why pandemic is also considered as a blessing in disguise for digital revolution. from the survey we conducted it can be seen that about 60% of the people were aware of the apps like microsoft teams zoom etc before the pandemic on the other hand there were about 40% of the people who were not aware during the pandemic the screen time of an average individual has increased a lot the following pie chart shows the screen time of an average individual during a particular day Rupee is a digital payment solution launched by NPCI National Payment Corporation of India in which payments can be made as easily by scanning a QR code this is a very helpful tool because it has now made payments much more easier from the given pie chart we can observe that 28.60% people prefer offline payment and 71.40% people prefer digital payments in this pie chart 
we can observe that 71.40 percentage of people feel that development in digital market is important and 28.60 percent people feel that development in digital market is not important. As the digital shift was observed, so were the consequences felt. Due to lack of purchasing power, many of the lower income groups could not afford laptops or good internet connections, which affected their overall development. On an interrogation with them, majority of them responded that they were not aware of the term digital revolution. Yet they somewhat knew about it as they were connected through social media apps like WhatsApp, Facebook, etc. So we can conclude that for lower income groups, the rise in digital revolution was evident while it was not the case with most of them. The graph here shows that internet access was low among economic vulnerable groups. Globally, only 24% people of high economic vulnerable groups could afford internet connection. Many of them even did not have good internet connection. In developing economies like India, only 21% people of high economic vulnerable groups could afford internet access in some or other way. While considered of developed economies like the USA and Australia, 77% people of high economic vulnerable groups could afford internet access, which was even more than global 74% of low economic vulnerable groups. in the market trend as well. I think sales of digital items are also based. What are your comments on that? Well, yes, of course. I mean, uh, everybody was on uh, online platform and there was a time when uh, about four or five months ago, I think last lockdown, there was a shortage of all the digital equipments like laptops and other things. I, I think uh, online is better. Uh, within a, such a short span of a time, you can do n number of activities and there's nothing can stop you, a weather or a anything, you don't have to go there and you don't have to find out yeah, I need to have a holiday to go to that bank and then to stand in the queue and to do that. I think uh, online is better. And are you aware of the term digital revolution? Yes, very much. And do you prefer payment to online mode or offline mode? Yes, we prefer payment to so through our project, we observed that the digital sector of the economy had a considerable surge resulting in the rise of digital revolution. As the market switched to digital mode, demand for digital products grew considerably. With the introduction of new apps, the use of online apps has increased as well. People are now also preferring digital payments more as compared to offline payments. Therefore, we can conclude that the rise in digital revolution was evident to only those who could afford to go digital. People from lower socioeconomic categories who lacked access to digital technology suffered. People were able to make cashless payments after the introduction of e-rupee which aided in both prevention from virus and provided a rapid way of payment. It was made feasible only due to digital revolution.